Bro. Finally, after so long. What is with Thanks, all these, man. these games launching halfway while I'm trying to start the freaking recording? Like y'all, y'all gotta wait just a second because I can't, I can't keep up. I'm just trying to start my OBS launcher, and it's another. It's been okay. years. Years. Decades at least. Oh my. Since I've been inside this house. I lived here when I was just a kid, with my family. Alright. My mom, my siblings, my, uh, my dad. Notice I received the, a call uh, from Tobias dad. telling me that they were finally ready with the repairs this morning. Alright. Took cool. them long enough. Cool stuff. Cool beans. <laughs> Even what? after what happened, and all that time away from home, it looks just like I remembered it to be. <laughs> really? Is my memory that precise? Uh, of course, things like the furniture and photos aren't here anymore, but hey, can't blame anybody for that. <laughs> Bro, that is so not. Right, right. I guess I better use that memory for something useful. I don't have the full story, nor do I know why it happened, but I can tell you how it started. What? Everything else is up to you to figure out. Bro, no. This is the story of the night I lost my home, huh? my childhood, and almost my family. When Five Nights at Freddy's just ended. Oh, oh, this is Scott. Story mode. Ah, uh, epilepsy warning. What is cooking, ladies and gentlemen? I am Casper J, and welcome to the Joy of Creation Story Mode. It is a Five Nights at Freddy's fan game that is supposedly one of the hardest and just scariest games ever. Officially started to uh, be made by a random team, and then Scott Cough himself was also working on the game at some point. I don't know when, but I have always really wanted to play this game. I know... From what I've heard, it's actually pretty scary because it's one of the most realistic looking games. But yeah, be sure to uh, like and subscribe and stuff like that. I honestly don't really know anything about this game. I know what the bedroom is, but I don't know about the stuff in it. Huh? Uh, hello? Uh, what are you doing in our house? Uh huh? Yes, yes, he's okay. Is Don't the stranger he's, okay? He's confused. Uh, ex excuse me, sir, can you tell me your name? Oh, look, man, if you won't talk, I'm calling the police. That sounds like phone guy. Just barge into someone's house like this. Are you hurt? Do you need any help? Honey, what's going on? I don't know. This man suddenly appears in our house. Uh. Bro, calm down. What? I, uh, I mean, by uh, uh, my name. Michael Afton. I, uh, uh, you, you asked me that b before. Uh, <laughs> Awkward much, Michael? Excuse me, but just what are you doing in our house? Yeah, like what's going on? The sun's about to go down. I don't think you should be here. Uh, yeah, I was just saying that. You, uh, you, uh, you, you look a little bit roughed up. What happened to you? I, 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 I don't know. I can't remember. Um, I'm sorry, but, but I just... I, I just don't know. Michael, pick it up. The floor is bad. Dad, can you help Michael? The floor is bad? What? I, I mean, I, I guess. Can you stand? I, I think so. Could you get this flashlight out of my face, bro? Okay, so we're Michael. Michael Afton. So is this After that, oh. Dad carried the stranger to our guest room. He oh. thanked me for convincing my parents to let him rest in our house for a night. Or at least, while he collected his thoughts. We're playing the kid! From the door! After that, Mom put me in bed. Okay. I can't remember much about Michael, but I knew he wasn't a bad person. Or, at least he didn't look, you know, dangerous. Okay, okay. I was young, so I guess I just didn't know any better. Certainly didn't know what a burglar was, that's for sure. I see. Um, not that I was implying he was, I'd never talk to him again after that. Oh. Well, except for when the storm happened. That's when I woke up on my bed, 
and I saw them. Oh no. Oh no, I've been getting shivers up my spine. <laughs> I can tell stuff is about to go down. Uh, press escape not to show again. Press X to continue. Press spacebar to stand up or sit down. Press left click to interact with objects. Look up while sitting and uh, hold left click to sleep. Alright, stand up. Okay. What the frick? Hello? Hello, hello, uh, Nick? Uh, hey, little Nicky, it's me, Michael. Man, uh, hey, you don't say anything back to me, okay? There are monsters around that'll hear you if you do. Now, don't be scared, Nick, okay? Listen to me, and we can defeat those monsters, alright? Uh, okay, so these monsters might look, uh, surreal. Uh, you know, don't look at them too long, or you'll feel weird and see creepy things. When you do, turn uh, on your desk lamp this is your bed. You'll feel safe there. Oh. The more you stare at the scary monsters, the worse you'll feel. All right. Okay. Uh, all right. All right. All right. Um. Okay. First things uh, first. Uh, oh. Freddy, uh, the fuzzy brown bear. Uh, he's at the window. Nick. Uh, he'll peek inside. Okay. Close your curtains and keep them closed until you hear him leave, or else he'll get inside. Okay. Uh, then there's Bonnie, the uh, ill-tempered big purple bunny. Okay. Uh, oh. Keep an eye on your door. And he'll be there. Which one? Uh, he's not shy at all. Uh, he will knock on the door to let you know he's there. Okay. Once he opens the door, shut off the lights as fast as you can, Nikki. He can't see you well in the dark, and he'll leave. Uh, oh, but make sure you're sitting down when you do that, all right? Okay, uh, then there's the chicken. Um, that one's a little bit weird. Um, check the closets often. Uh, if she's peeking through, make sure to disable the lights. Uh, she doesn't want to be seen, but ignoring her doesn't help either. If she does what? catch you with the lights on, she'll scare you and stun you. Oh. Now look, I, I know this is a lot to take in. Little yeah. Lady, okay, just just listen carefully. I'm scared. And try to remember it all. I will. Thanks. All right. Last is Foxy. Uh, he'll be right beneath your bed, Nick. What? You'll hear scraping from the bottom of the crib when he's there. Uh, be watchful if you see his hook on the back of your bed, because soon enough he'll be right there next to the bed. Uh, don't look directly at him, Nick. Instead, oh. pretend to sleep. All right, just pretend to sleep. Yeah, just lie down without moving too much. Look up and close your eyes. Okay. Uh, Foxy sees eyes as if they're big, bright spotlights, okay? So if you pretend to sleep, he won't know you're there anymore. But don't open them until you know he's gone, okay? Okay. Okay, uh, so to recap, um, Freddy is at the window, so yep. if you see him peeking, close the curtains until he's gone. Thank you. Uh, Bonnie will knock on the door and open it afterwards. Uh, disable the lights and sit down until he leaves. Chica will try to stun you by scaring you, so if you see her peeking through the closet, shut off your lights and don't pretend to sleep. She'll okay. think you're gone. And Foxy will appear under your crib and move uh -huh. upwards, so when he's next to your bed, pretend to sleep until you hear him leave. Got it. All right, you got all that? All right, good. Uh, listen, I have to go, little buddy. Okay, just Why? hang in there. Okay, Stay here, at please. 6 a.m., I'm sure of it. You can do this. Go. Please don't. I'm, I'm scared. I'm scared. What happens if I leave the light off for too long? Get down! Hello? Okay. Oh! He's still there. What are these sounds, bro? I don't know what to do. I mean, I do, but like... Get down! Oh my god. Oh, Freddy will get in if he sees you through the window. I know, but Chica was there. At the same time, Chica was there, so if I had tried to do that, she would have stunned me and Freddy probably would have gotten in. Oh. 
That thumping, is that? No, the door doesn't open. Should I still go down? No, okay, so he's just testing my reaction skills. I need to sit and wait, and if I hear him actually start to, like, open the door, then I go down. Um... Like that? Oh! Freddy, why? I closed the curtain! I don't like the way they make us move around the crib like this. Oh! Dang this game. Bro! I did 10 seconds. Oh, that's the audio cue for when he's gone. I... It just turned one. Alright, that's the sound for him going. Uh. What? Get down! Oh! Chica! Ladies, one one at a time, guys. I don't oh, know. <laughs> they all closed at once. That was good. That was good timing right there. Uh Chica, I'm sorry. I don't see Foxy. Sleep! Are we good? Okay, uh, my vision gets weird if I turn the light off for too long. Oh, jeez. Chica! I know. Don't. Bonnie? Is he gone? That was quick. Oh! I called that one. I had a feeling he was gonna come in. Sorry. Close it! Get down! Bro. Chica left me alone? What's wrong? I, I'm going insane. Uh, I'm confused. Okay, do I need to sit down? Oh, Chica. Chica. I can't see. Uh, I don't know who I died to, but play uh, plan ahead before he blocks your items. Blocks your items? What? What are they on about? Even now when the lights are off, my character isn't acting like weird at all. Don't know what I did wrong there. Honestly, this this is a hard game to commentate. Like, I'm just trying to pay attention and listen, kind of. Honestly, though, I can still hear, so... Why why did I start going insane? Oh, oh okay. I, th I thought Freddy was at the window, but... Because I had the light on. Sleeping didn't make it better. Laying down didn't make it better. I like it better when it's not raining. Chica?
I pretty narrowly just dodged all of them at once. So, we wait for Foxy's claw to actually make that sound. How long do we stay asleep? I don't really know. You gotta go, Chica. Foxy's gonna be here in a second. Stays there forever. Okay, listen. We're good. We're fine. Foxy has not actually done anything. Oh shoot, I forgot to turn off the lamp. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Go sleep! See, my screen starts to get all grainy. And is that part of the graphics because I set it on high? Or is that just because I am going insane? Okay. I think we're good. I'm going insane. Why is everything shaking? Please, Foxy's coming. I don't have time for this. Go down, sleep! Are you good? What am I... We're having a panic attack right now. Calm down. I'm dead, I'm dead. Okay. Please, I don't know why you're freaking out. I can't concentrate. Oh my god. No, there's some... They said to turn on the lamp. Okay, it was just Chica. Definitely need to turn the lamp on, I think. Foxy, wait. Um, my. I guess my character's really afraid. tell we're at the cusp of victory right now. I can feel it. I can feel it! But no, we don't let up our guard. There's something I'm not doing, is there? Isn't there? No! Oh! I'm dead. I'm dead. Ah! No. If you... Yeah, if you close it the second he appears, like, literally the second, it seems like he disappears a lot quicker. They're all coming at once. I heard Foxy, too. Alright, let me turn that off. Chica gives you a lot of time, too. Like, she, she will wait a few seconds. Alright, that was really quick. Bro.
what's happening. Do we make it? I don't know what that weird face was. And <gasps> oh, I... do we make it? Oh, we made. It. Okay. Uh, two years of Five Nights at Freddy's. Greater content's the occasional by releasing brand new game behind the scenes screenshots. Uh, learn how to make your own games. Oh my gosh, I am shivering. Oh. Oh my gosh, that was super tense. My heart is beating. I think we made it. Yes, we did it. Uh, we beat the bedroom, I believe. Yep. Uh, and then this is living room. They both sound cool. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. All right, we're gonna save the living room for the next episode. That was the Joy of Creation story mode. We have officially beaten the first room. It took a little bit. It took about a couple of days for me, but we finally got it done. Be sure to like and subscribe and um all that good stuff comment down below who do you think is the scariest animatronic of the bedroom and i would very much appreciate it if you subscribe because we are at 400 subscribers which is absolutely giga chad casserole j is now out